Hi there. Welcome to this short podcast looking at impressions we can get from sources. Here we've got a source that could well be in the June 2014 exam. It's a painting showing William Morton performing an operation in Boston Hospital in the United States of America using ether for the first time. So what impression can we get? Well, if we look very, very carefully, we start to make some quite interesting inroads. First off, the impression we can get is that it must have been something of a novelty, because we've got lots of people all staring in at the operation. Notice that these two people here, the patient, the surgeon and the patient, are the centre of attention. We can see the interest in people's eyes as they look at the operation. This man here clearly is very excitable about it. He's got out of his seat to have a look. We can also tell there's a genuine concern about the patient. This chap here, look, he's got his hands on the patient's hand. Maybe checking a pulse. But it's showing that this must have been quite a novelty to see an operation performed with somebody unconscious. Because people are very, very fearful of the health and want to know what's going on. All around the room, people are looking. This indicates that this must have been almost um, a showcase, an experiment to see if either would work. In terms of our, in terms of loaded language, we would have a written source. We don't have that here, but what we do have is the use of colour. Notice at the, at the front, it's all very, very sterile and white not the kind of typical images we would have associated with 18 forces operations where there will be blood everywhere this seems quite important significant the patient and the surgeon are the center of attention again notice the gaze people have there isn't it's, this guy's leaning over there isn't anybody who's um seemingly angered by this there seems to be no protest this chap over here seems to be questioning it this over here this is the ether dome where the drug had been applied to do well with a question two you simply have to provide the impression that this was a significant event and provide evidence to support that i hope this has been useful Please make sure you have a look at the podcast as to how to answer a question too. And good luck with your exams in the future.